Jersey. <laughs> Big dots. Whee! And I was ready to shoot, Jack. I was ready to shoot, Jack. That might be off. Okay. <laughs> Trays up. Splash down. I'm ready to shoot, Jack. Ah! Trays up. Splash down. I'm ready to shoot, Jack. Trays up. Splash down. And I got on green machine, so once I shoot one green, if I'm even close with the stick, the rest of them go green. All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. NBA 2K21, man, we got a lot of loot. A little bit of news for y'all today, man. We got Ticino versus Aiden last night, the first wager of the year. We got Stiso the God talking about. What was he talking about? What else would he be talking about? Ankle breakers. And last but not least, we have information on when ruffles will be coming so if you don't do anything else man make sure y'all hit that like button because hitting the like button helps the video go out to everybody helps me get into recommended we got recommended yesterday on the patch notes video and we were right below the steso video man i was so crunk my boy t mizzle sent me that information this morning i was like yes we getting up there so you know i'd like to do that again man if we can get 200 likes in the first hour that would be awesome if we can't then you know it is what it is man i'm gonna keep bringing the news keep grinding we got a jump shot video coming for y'all later on today and all of that stuff man so like i said make sure you like like the video subscribe for more daily 2k content and uh i'm gonna give y'all five seconds to like the video real quick and then we're gonna go on with it five four three two one Lito! if you make it to c25 that's og status i was told you could be anything just don't be average down bad flat pipes that shit made me sad start hustling non-stop don't plan on breaking that head all right folks now tacino played your boy aiden ross last night man and the reason that we got this video up here man is because I just wanna, I wanna uh, offer my condolences and stuff like that because it seems like Ticino is just really hurting right now. And while uh, what he said was, he just said, worst shooting performance of my whole dang life. It's, it was pathetic. Uh, not gonna make any excuses. They won fair and square. Really heated right now. But GG's to Aiden Ross and, uh, and not cuff him. Haven't been this mad over a loss in a long time. Uh, in a long time, man, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get back. Love y'all. And uh, pretty much, man, what he was saying is that he just had a bad shooting night. This is why I said I don't like to gamble and stuff like that, especially on stuff like 2K, because of the fact that when you gamble on 2K, you 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 got two things. You may have a bad night, and then you know it's it's the game is gonna give you some bad stuff, man. Right here, what I'm showing is, you know, I know we know that Tyson likes to shoot the ball. He likes to shoot fades. He likes to do all this type of stuff, man. And I'm just trying to, I'm, this is just my two cents on the whole thing. If you feel like you're shooting bad and you feel like you're not shooting consistency, consistently, I invite you to try the shot stick. This guy right here, this is my center. I'm playing on Hall of Fame. I'm going to show y'all that in a second. Playing this game on Hall of Fame, you know you're going to get screwed because some of the joints that you shoot that are green, they're just not going to turn green. I'm a center. I don't have difficult shots like that right there. That was perfectly centered. It didn't turn green. That's the Hall of Fame effect. I'm a center. I don't have difficult shots. And I know that as a shot creator, his stuff, his, all of his stats are higher than mine. So if I can do this as a center on Hall of Fame, I know that he can do it, you know, in the park with with you know with whatever the park setting is and all of that stuff and he's always playing on delay so when you're playing on delay using the shot stick it gives you two chances at a green and it really keeps you from having to even worry about uh you know i can't time my shot and stuff like that because as long as you put on hall of fame flexible release and you time your shot reasonably well and as y'all saw right there uh as y'all saw right there i had it on I've, I've got it on, uh, did I roll it back? Yeah, you see right there, it's on Hall of Fame difficulty. That's what I'm doing in the my court. And we know that playing out there is not is not as bad. So I say just give it a try because you don't have to worry about timing as much. Timing does play a key. If you hit it, then if you get good timing, if you got reasonably good timing, you're gonna be able to hit. But it just shows that, you're gonna see that in this video right here, but I just say, hey, give that a try because you're gonna hit all your fades, you're gonna green a lot of fades, and you have two chances at that green. So you you got centered timing, and then you, have, you got centered, and you have actual timing. But hey, it is what it is. Who am I? I'm just a nobody YouTuber, but that's just my two cents. 
Uh, like I said, I don't like I don't like to see when people in the community just feel like they're struggling or something like that, man. And I, you don't got to struggle. Just give this a try. I promise you, you won't go back. And like you saw, you, you saw I was able to do some of your signature jump shots that Ticino does. Like, you're not going to be able to do the spin jumpers and stuff like that. But I haven't figured out how to do that with the stick. If anybody has, let me know down in the comment section. But, hey, it is what it is. Just keep watching the video. And I'm going to drop jewels on that. But anyway, Aiden comes along. He just says, regardless of what happened tonight, I love you, Ticino. I respect you beyond content career. Of beyond the content creator you really are the ish and um look at this first shot right here it wasn't centered but i want y'all i want i want to show you this right here this is why i shoot with the stick because it my first shot look at that it wasn't centered but i had excellent timing and sometimes i'll have i'll have mediocre timing but i'll have excellent it'll be centered and then sometimes it'll be both so you get two chances at a green. I just think it's great. It's double the risk, though, but it's, it's, it's the reward. I feel like it's great, man. Anyway, he just said, uh, you know, you know, I'm, I'm, it's going to be fun, my brother. Uh, good luck to you. Ticino says, good luck to you, my friend. Now, if you don't know, they wagered last night, and uh, Ticino and Chrissy T came out. Game one, house of fire, boom, beat Aiden and uh, beat Aiden and his squad. Right there, look again. You see Brutus Sam taking that shot right there. You see it says wide right, but he got his animation because he got the timing right. So you're getting the boost on both of them. So you're going to hit more shots regardless. But uh, Aiden, Aiden and uh, Cuffham went down 2-0, and then they came back. And uh, and I think they backdoor swept it uh, 4-2. Four, four so they won. They lost the first two games, and then they won the next four. And uh, Tyson said, like you said, he just wasn't hitting shots. He just wasn't able to do what he what he wanted to do. And I'm just like, bro, like you might as well give it a shot. Here, see right there, right there. That time it was late, but I was centered. We're gonna we're gonna look at it one more time. Uh, look at that time is slightly late, but centered. The ball goes in. You get two chances at a green. If you double up, then you just double up. But um. Well, the part that I don't like, um, you know, I, the, the part that I don't like is the, the way that the 2K community came in and they just, they just, they just like, hey, well, not Nate. Nate just said Ticino missing open all series. What the world? And like we said, we already know that, that they tune, they tune shooting a little bit. They tune the phase. They tuned a lot of the stuff, man. Uh, you know, you got, we got, uh, then you got the toxic, the toxicity of the community. Ticino afraid to shoot uh 2k uh what, what is it real bron 2011 vibes uh you know they they, they got tacino is a hell all of this none of this is true after that after the after that aiden versus tacino series i better never hear anybody put him in the same sentence as rat that's crazy but that's nonsense this is the part where people just get out of hand and get out of pocket uh tacino i thought you was good at 2k obviously he's a great player man come on man y'all get out there and put up a thousand dollars of y'all money because people always talk trash but they ain't, they ain't gonna, uh, and then people just say WTF, Ticino, whatever, and uh, Ticino, and nothing could be further from the truth with that. But, uh, you know, like I said, man, it's tough because I'm, I'm just putting these tweets out there to just show people how people do, man. When you're on top, you on top. When you winning, it's like you'll never lose another game. But then when you when you lose, they just dog pile on you. And I just think that's lame as hell. If that's your guy, that's your guy. But D, I bet if we go far enough back, we'll look at these same dudes and they're going to be like, hey, man, you're the greatest, Ty. I want to be like you. Or those are the people that that, that they probably asked him for a shout out or, or asked him to buy a PS4 and he was and he respectfully declined or something like that. They probably feel shunned by him in some way. But your haters be your biggest fans and we all know that in the 2K community. Like I said, though, if you want to i just say try using the shot stick especially on those face and stuff just because of the fact that you get two shots at two chances at a green i never even hesitate now when i'm taking shots just because of the fact that i know i got two chances at that green and once you learn how to use that shot stick man look at brute not well he threw a lob and they did that right there i should have took the shot let me kick it up top look at him he gonna pull it from right there tray ball Cash, pipe it up. I got the price on reserve. You can hit shots like that, and we know that you got it, man. So, like I said, let's give it a try. If y'all think he, he ain't gonna see the video anyway. Up next, though, we got um the NBA 2K 2K Insider talking about ruffles, man. And it just says that NBA 2K support says that the ruffles event will come out within three weeks. And uh, you know, we got the uh, we just got the little joints here, man. Um. Let's do it like this. And it just says, you know, Ruffles next gen, Ruffles right. And it just says, yes, less than a month away. And somebody else came through and it just says, um, so within the next three weeks, you'll be able you uh so within the next three weeks, you can you can keep updated on the forum. Sorry, I wish I had more help here. Um, you know, is there anything else I can help you with? Obviously, they got that information that they was out. 
on that one because they know they know that uh you know hey once you get your information it ain't a point in staying there like that man but check this out man we shot eight for nine that game and all of us use the shot stick man this shot stick gang i'm just saying hey you know give it a try and uh hopefully it helps out but last but not least man you got your boy steve show the god talking about ankle breakers man and he's just saying nah 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 ankle breakers are op asf as the f right now ha 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 expect the video today and uh obviously he did do that and uh we'll see it right here it just pops up and it just says um you know let's just watch a little bit of this video real quick by your boy steve soda god mm. nobody asked you nothing bixby <laughs> but Steezo is a fool, bro. Yes. Huh. <laughs> Get over here. Huh. Ah, ah. Pull up. Drink. <laughs> Still that money about like Steve, girl. Cash. Pay me up. I got a place to reserve. Activist. Pretty much, this is a video, man, where he's talking about, um... I mean, just look, the ankle breakers. Tray ball, money gam, trays up, splash down. <laughs> we are back. How y'all doing? Oh, man. Ah, right, you know we can't we can't be getting no copyright, man. But anyway, I just wanted to show that man to let y'all know that he he put out a video. He's letting y'all know that ankle breakers are back, and uh, he's got this video out showing you the the moves that you can do to get ankle breakers. Pretty much every single time, man. And uh, like we say, I think everybody knows the ankle breakers are overpowered right now. I think mostly everybody knows all the moves that you can do in order to get the ankle breakers. What? I think that, uh, you know, he just wanted to shed light on this and say, hey, we know they might need to be toned down just a tad. Uh, let me, I'm gonna put him in the background. They might, these ankle breakers might just need to be toned down just a tad, but I'm gonna have fun with them, you know, while they're here. And so, like you said in this video, he's just letting you know, you know, all the moves you can do. And uh, he just goes into real depth with it. So, y'all let me know down in the comment section. Do y'all think ankle breakers are OP right now? Or do you think this is just retribution because y'all didn't really get really anything as far as a playmaking take he said he don't even got on playmaking takeover right here but do you think that uh that the ankle breakers are op right now or do you think that uh they just need to tone them down just a little bit and then you know we can go back to normal because like i said i, I was playing against a dude yesterday dude had on off ball pest breaking my ankles and i'm gonna do a video on that uh later on just to see if that really works the way that I think it did. But he had me look a hooing and rubbernecking and all that type of stuff, man. But you know, just let me know down in the comment section what y'all think. Do y'all think anchor breakers are broken right now? Do they just need to leave them right here for a little bit longer? And you know, just so the uh so the play the playmakers can get some get back and then change them, or do they just need to change them immediately? I think what it is is they just they turn things up, and when they continue to turn it up. Like, they really just can't fix it the way that they want to fix it. So they have to keep turning it up, turning it up, turning it up until it seems broken. And then once it seems broken, they uh they can scale it back. So we'll see how that goes, man. But y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section. And uh, I'm going to get it y'all next time. Make sure you like the video. And until uh, next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ. Guys,